at this dude. Whoosh, Pappin, everybody, welcome back to another video. Oh, hey man, if you haven't already, then so make sure you are subscribed to the channel, smash the like button, click that bell while you're at it so you can be a part of the post note gang family, best family on YouTube, and that's no cap, hands down. Hell. <laughs> hey man, we are here for my boy Devontae the One, smelling bad in school. Hmm. I think I've had some times where I was like, ooh, you know, in school. But that's why you got to keep that emergency spray, you know, that body spray, maybe even some cologne if you could afford it back in school. And then uh, obviously an extra stick of deodorant. Make sure you keep that in your backpack, bro. <laughs> hey, man, we're going to do less talking, more reacting. Let's dive right into this video. Let go. I think one of the worst things somebody could have going for them, you know, besides watching your favorite character get a power up and still getting their cheeks ran through. Is you being getting their cheeks ran through? Stink. Hygiene is an essential aspect of life. It lets people know, dang, he takes shots. Those are one of my pet peeves, especially when it comes to a female, bro. If a female beat, bro, it is a turn off. That's a quick way to get exited out the door. Hours and his breath don't smell like old man throat. Dang, she look good and don't smell like the rotten fruit up top of grandma's fridge. So she gotta be clean. Dang, I can be around them and not wanna off myself. I don't know a single soul on this planet who wanna meet somebody and the first thing they experience with you is your mouth, pits, and mm -mm area smelling like pig neck and crocodile spit. Like for real, look what happened to SpongeBob. Bro was so musty, he literally. Bro, I hate that. I hate that. And one of the you 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 you'll definitely experience that if you get locked up go to jail bro you will run into the most stinkiest people bro i Thwarted swear a man's face who wants to experience that nobody especially if you go to school you just setting yourself up for a squad wipe at that point that the part. last thing you want to do is walk up in there smelling like the inside of palpatine's hood shoot if the sith got you smelling like that you bro th that probably uh flashbacks in regards of when you get on somebody's ass bro last year i got locked up and I was only locked up for a couple of weeks, but there's one dude ended up coming into our uh, into GP with us, and he stunk so bad the whole pod was at on his ass, bro. He ended up crying, and the COs had to come in and force him to go take a shower, bro, because we was on his ass so much. Better think twice bro. about joining the dark side, Anakin. See, there's two types of musty people in this world besides the ones with medical issues. The folks that slip up one or two times and forget their deodorant, and the folks that's too lazy and unfocused. The in musty the bums to make are the worst. Deodorant on a priority. A Musty bum. Funny thing is, both of their consequences are the same. They either gotta ask somebody for help or they gotta try to hide it. And I don't know anybody ready to smear barbecue sauce under their armpits because nobody wanna help them. <laughs> so guess what? We hiding, my boy. Back in 11th grade, I forgot my deodorant a couple times. Damn. Yeah, I was that lazy, unfocused, musty bum every blue moon. But don't worry, I ain't like that no more. All these tough years done got me right. I remember my first. <laughs> hey, man, you live, you learn. First time. I was on the bus myself i can't remember why the booty cheeks out bro but i was rushing to get to school that day for some reason good mood for a shower breakfast in my stomach i'm ecstatic i got everything on my agenda done before i left the house except for the most crucial thing my deodorant shoot at least if i forgot to call them white pits pits to brush my teeth i got the option to not talk to nobody this is outrageous i didn't realize i forgot my deodorant until i got to third period football workouts once i figured that out all that confidence jumped out the window and superman wasn't yo i swear i swear your confidence levels be going down if you forget to put on deodorant i swear it's happened to me a few times i'm not gonna lie like, I wouldn't even say more, more so recently, but it's happened to where, like, you're getting ready, you're going out. Even if it's as simple as going to the store real quick, you'd be like, oh, fuck, I forgot to put the... Oh, yeah, I forgot to put them on. So you just kind of, like, walk around with your armpits down, bro. <laughs> this had me shooketh because I knew there was a possibility I'd end up on Channel 5 because of the football workouts amplifying the, must. the musty And don't y'all hit me with that. Devontae, y'all ain't have no showers in the locker room. You smoking squirrel foot if you think I'm finna make myself vulnerable at all and get hold. I went through enough already with these heathens in the video I explained before, so I'm good. I'd rather smoke smell like kangaroo pouch all day then get in my birthday suit and shower with the ops my pride wouldn't let me that like that player i don't care if you think i must have lost my mind because in life 
tough decisions must be made. The only thing that saved me a little bit was my hoodie to trap the stank in, walking yeah. and sitting with my- But then you end up stinking even more because then you're getting all hot and sweaty underneath that hoodie, depending on how cold or hot it is, but- Pits shut and going to the bathroom to wipe my pits every 15 minutes, which in itself was a hassle because we had assigned seats. So if I sit in the back, I'm cooked. There's no way I'm walking through that crowd of people and not have someone end up on a t-shirt. And don't let the must be at full power. That's when you start seeing signs. At that point, what's stank in the dark will smell in the light. That one kid pulls his shirt over his nose around you. That brother's being nice. You hear that one guy say, dang, it's stinking here. Next thing you know, you start hyperventilating and overthinking because it feel like all eyes. So your face starts turning red and then you start sweating even more, which causes even stress sweat start <laughs> appearing. <laughs> are on you your body gets stiff so the last thing you think about doing is moving at all because if part. you do the whole class gonna flop like fish do and you better pray the teacher don't call you up to the board because if that happens Ooh. you're done a girl pulls out her purse spray and sprays in your area but not like directly at you at that point you ain't getting no women zero you might as well just cut off your hair and become a monk because no wife is in your future Damn. somebody asks the teacher to get up and go sit in a seat far away from you somebody get up and start smelling people he gets to you and says it ain't you but you know good and well it is you bruh it's as if everybody became spot the musty sense better man the second you walked in the building which sucks because all these signs happen to me coming from third period i get to fourth period a little sweaty but still chilling because the must was not that potent and i had a front row seat at the far right of the room so i was safe at the you end of go. fourth period i smell my pits and almost dig a grade for myself because the must started getting stronger. The stanko meter. Anxiety at level 10. So I get the fifth period early. Thought I was safe. Man, that anxiety stress is on some other, like you got stress sweat, but anxiety stress on a whole different level. And for me, I, I have severe anxiety. And sometimes when I, my anxiety be going, whoo, I start sweating, bro. I start sweating in places I didn't know I could sweat it. Until the teacher told me to sit in my assigned seat. You know what that was? The back. You smoking turtle thigh if you think I was finna get up for anything sitting in that back. I can't go to the bathroom. I can't go to the board. I can't even sharpen my pencil. I better suffer. If I'm taking a test, I better ask somebody for a pencil. And even then, I gotta keep my distance. And at this point, that's the only thing I worried about every single period. It's like the more I kept focusing on it, especially you with start my sweating anxiety more. almost through the freaking roof, the stronger it became. The that stink part. kept growing as I kept going. When six period came around, that's when the game changed. I didn't want to get to this period for a reason. They had me smack dab in the middle of the classroom. Oh, that's tough. There's nowhere to run. I'm surrounded. At this point, I'm about to do a splash spread stank attack and have everybody restart the game. My stank was at full power. Anxiety level 100. My boy Kirito couldn't defeat this boss even if he hacked the game. Like, I couldn't hide it from anyone fully anymore. So you might as well call out sick. You might as well go home at this point. So everything happened in perfect fashion. I walk in the room early, prepping myself mentally for the inevitable. I sit my behind in that chair and I ain't move a muscle. Stiff body, pitch shut. Next thing I know. You're overthinking it. God, hey, it's stinking here, Mr. Teacher. Mm. Spraying it right on him. Damn. Um, Mr. Teacher, it smells like bounce that back in here. Can I go sit in another seat? <laughs> nah, it ain't you. Bro, Captain, it's me, cuz it's me. How'd you pull that one off? Those were the worst 35 minutes of my life. I can the only, only thing getting me up at that chair before everyone left the class had to be Yah himself. I don't care if there was a fire drill, the clan pulled up, Fleece Johnson popped in. I ain't moving. You sure about that big dog? <laughs> You sure about that big dog? No, I ain't gonna lie, man. Like, I like there are there have been times where I forgot to put on deodorant. But honestly, you're better off just asking someone. Hey, yo, bro, you you got some deodorant I can borrow? I promise you, like that. That's the next move I make. I and before you use somebody else's deodorant, make sure you wipe the couple layers off the off the stick first before you you feel me. You, you don't want to put what they. You feel me? Just be clean. <laughs>
<laughs> hey man if y'all made it to the end i do greatly greatly appreciate it man make sure y'all smashing that like button leaving a comment down below and clicking that bell while you're at it until next time i'm gonna see y'all next time i'm out